Alright, howdy howdy. Playing some Renekton today up against a Trendomir, which is not going to be fun. But we'll see how this goes. Plan on going for. I usually go the like PTA Bork one shot build. Ow. But uh, not today. Got him. Got his ghost out too. Okay, so yeah, that works. I don't know what it is today, but people, I, people have been going up against keep just running under tower. All right, Mumu is about to die. That is bone plating out of them. Alright, so... An enemy has been slain. Okay, it's going well. Yeah, I don't care if you hold that there. He's nearly killable again. An ally has been slain. An enemy has oh, I'm dead. Slain. Yep. Fuck. You have been slain. Okay, uh, not smart. Mumu can easily kill if a Mumu just walks top. So let's see. Okay, so he's got some kills now. He got a kill, but all of us have some kills. Except for a Mumu. But he might be able to just walk up and smack Trinity right now if he stays. Dude, he's, he's still there. He walked right where you were going to go. Oh my goodness. He was a free kill. All he had to do was just walk to where Trinomir was running. Oh shit. Okay. Alright, so, going for Ravenous. I'll explain it in a second. I just wanna... I'll also explain Renekton. So, Renekton. Uh, my attacks and abilities generate Fury when I have 50 Fury. My next uh, ability is Empowered. Uh, also, Trinomir is just bad. So, Q is that swing around me, deals a bunch of damage, heals me as well. Used to heal for a lot more, but Riot hates Renekton for some reason. Uh, w, it's a stun. 0.5 or 0.75 seconds if it's empowered then it's a 1.5 second stun and does a lot of damage it's really good if you run pta because his empowered w counts as three auto attacks 
So it instantly procs PTA, instantly procs Bork, stuff like that. E is a dash. If you hit a enemy, you get a second dash. And then R, kind of like Nasus R, get a lot bigger area effect around me. And then uh, I gain 250 max health and it passively generates fury. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Q with more or q with fury does a lot more damage he was a lot more w is a longer stun e the second dash is the only one that uses fury the first dash doesn't but the second dash uh armor shreds and does more damage so now my wave clear is absolutely nutty I should be able to. Sweet. So, Trendemir is an interesting matchup. His ult makes him unkillable, so. They can. Yeah, that works. Oh, that definitely works. Got him to use his fury, which is really good for me. So his fury is stupid. So the red bar under him. Kind of like the red bar under me is his fury. He generates it from auto attacks and killing stuff. His fury gives him crit chance. And then... Come on, spin on me, dude. I know he wants to. Oh, there's Graves. Wait, why? Why did you not get Dragon? You killed their jungler. Okay, um, that's what I was worried about. He's just gonna shove the wave in. He doesn't have ult, so if a Mumu wants to come gank, then we can kill. in there all right sweet so I got that <coughs> excuse me <coughs> excuse me I don't know why we didn't get dragon whenever we killed their jungler and their support and had our entire team bot next up though gore drinker the fuck was that Um, so, Hydra is like the old Hydra, except now you can build up stacks for killing stuff. Uh, which increase your attack damage. So, you can max out at 40? You lose half your stacks on death. So, it's like, it's like an AD, um, what's, whatchamacallit? Magi's. Dude, why is our bot never moving? You don't have to shove in every wave. Just walk over, help him get the objective. Just like three and one, dude. Just take it. Cool. 
so I keep getting him to use his fury for like nothing. I don't know how many times this Amumu has to ping it. Try, bud, I guess. Alright. So, this Trinomir is just getting completely rolled. <sighs> Got it. I didn't want to use my Fury in case Graves... Okay, he's mid. I didn't want to use my Fury in case Graves was there, but Graves was in mid lane. I get tower. Might be able to. I think I can. Alright. So now I'll back. Definitely getting tabbies. Auto attack AD. Auto attack AD. Auto attack AD. A lot of auto attacks. The only CC they have is him. So I'll get tabbies. Yeah. Tabbies. Let's whip that. That. And then back to lane I go. So now, okay, so 65 attack damage. Attacks deal in a, attacks and abilities deal 144 physical damage to other enemies within 350. I currently got 20 attack damage, right? Yeah, so 20 extra attack damage. when he's fed. Me and Amumu can take this easy. We just started. If they try and come in, I'm massive. I'll kill him. right there. Take it there. Knock down that turret as well. Me. I come here. don't know where Trindamir is. I'm guessing he went to mid lane. Is he there? Oh my goodness. What the fuck? <laughs> Okay. Don't mind me, I still just have 2400 gold on me. So, yeah, a lot of damage. Because, I mean, I'm sitting at 250 AD. Let's see, what am I at now? 275 AD. Mm, yeah. 
270, 286 AD off of two items. Me and Akali are fucking massive. Jesus, this this Akali was one-shotting people though. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> so, Gore Drinker. I don't know why Caitlyn is like never here. Oh, he's just dead, huh? If a movie just walks here, it's free. Jungler is dead. Trinomir is split pushing top lane, but. We can just walk down mid. Cool, so this is one of those good games where my entire team is doing something, which is rare. So the ideal combo for Renekton, if I haven't talked about it, you want to... You want to be weaving your autos... You want to be weaving your autos... <laughs> oh boy. So you want to do like auto Q, auto W, auto E, auto E. You are what is commonly called an AD caster. Okay. So I'm going to back now. But ideally what you do is, because people never expect it. Um, I'll do it like this. Kind of building into two items, but. So, <clears throat> so like if there's a minion wave here, and I'm standing like right about here, I can E to a minion and then E to them. And if I have flash up, I have so much range that people never expected. So you wanna E in, if you have empowered W, you can. If not, you can auto then W. And then you, if they have a mobility of some kind, so like dash, dash, jump, all that, then you can, okay. Then you can E behind them. So they, even if they try and go out, then you're behind them as well. And then Q. Empowered Q, ideally for a bunch of damage, which might be a little bit difficult depending on how much uh, fury you have before you start fighting. But yeah, so that's that's for Nectin. and then you just start one-shotting people because Renekton scales very well with like this is doing seven. My Empowered W does 750 damage right now. Which is a lot of damage. Oh, he is ravenous too.
Okay. It's easy as that. Just flash in. W. Kill. I got him though. Alright, I lost half my stacks, so now I have a lot less damage, but uh, we got inhib. And now I can go for my death dance. So this has done 1800 damage to champions, just from the cleave. They haven't even been grouping, because I think they're turbo upset because everyone on their team is getting shit on. But so if you have a big AoE team fight and you go in, since all of your abilities cleave, and like W cleaves multiple times, you get so much damage off this. Uh, something I forgot to mention is that while I have less than half health, I gain increased fury. And it decays when you're out of combat. Oh, they could have waited four seconds. But. <clears throat> I want this because it makes my Hydra better. Oh. Okay. But yeah, so. Next up is Death Dance. Oh. Doesn't work on the little shits. I guess I'll go back top. I mean, I'm gonna lose all of this, but. Ooh. I think that's next. If the game even lasts that long. If I get to full build, then. I will be surprised because we are very, very far ahead. But. Look, I'm already nearly at full stacks again. Cool. Just wanna keep pushing waves and we can go for a triple inhib. So I will say the one thing that Ravenous doesn't trigger on is it won't trigger on like Gore Drinker. Just spells, so not items as well. But it doesn't matter, I can just one shot. Oh, so left. <laughs> okay then. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's Renekton. Oh, a really good game too. Whew. Take a look at these damages hard. I think Akali beat me on damage, but... Oh, it's so satisfying to beat a Trindamir. That champ's so annoying. Take a look. Oh, no, never mind. It's a lot of uh, damage. Turret damage. That's a lot. Take a look at healing. Yeah. That's Renekton. Just so much Omni Vamp. But, uh, yeah. If you like the video, like, subscribe. I stream on Twitch, twitch.tv slash c98dub. I also put up on YouTube, c98dub. There's a link to my Twitch on my YouTube, a link to my YouTube on my Twitch. See ya.